Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game! Let's get a recap. So, this is the air castle? Looks foreboding. Oh, if you're scared, just walk behind my big s behind big sister Kyra. Oh, be quiet. Giggle. So, that was not much of a recap, was it? So, to recap... The magical fire that we're supposed to use to destroy the evil force and get to the tower that is causing people to turn into zombies. The fire was stolen by these guys, and we need to get rid of them. Unfortunately, it's not as simple as going up and fighting them. These are just their illusions, and we have to go find the real ones to dispense of the fake ones. I already tried to the left, so let's go ahead and move to the right. Oh yeah, and the enemies here suck. Are we fighting a PlayStation controller? I really should consider using a variety of spells here. For example, Githu, because we know that these guys, the guys at the very least, are weak against lightning. Don't know anything about the stone heads yet. Yeah, that's definitely pretty good. I might even get away with the regular Thu. Ah, seriously, these guys are definitely putting up a bit of a beating on us. Thankfully, we are still gaining levels. I probably should go ahead and heal. Rune, you need more HP. You're like lagging behind everybody. You used to be stronger than everybody. What happened? Um. Okay, treasure. Money! Definitely need more of that. Gotta think of it. I. I wasn't able to buy equipment at that last town because I was not having enough money to do so. I'm suddenly regretting my decision not to grind for money. The various differences in amount of damage we take from spells like that is interesting. Some people have strong resistance, and some of us don't. Well, overall, I say we did pretty well in that fight. I don't have to heal this time. Okay, I know that these guys are kind of painful. Um... Use regular attacks for the moment. Except you. You... Gigra. Ow. Like, seriously, ow. These guys really do suck. Ugh. Okay, we got down to one. Um, hope it's almost dead. Well, doesn't matter because he only raised his defense, so he's definitely dead. Ugh, definitely should have taken the time to do some grinding. Oh well, we're live. Just to make sure... Yeah. Okay, so what's out here then? It's interesting that our journey through this castle takes us back outside the castle. Is this a path? No.
Um, treasure! Great to see these guys again. Alright, I know these guys hit really hard, so you know what? Screw all y'all. So far, that's the only combo I've got that actually works the way I want it to. And uh, that'll do for now. What's this? Trimate. Cool. Okay, this one's simpler. I can just have her attack that thing and everybody else attack the PlayStation controller. It is interesting that those are mouths. I'm suddenly imagining a PlayStation controller with the rumble, except the rumble is caused by it licking the inside of its mouth. Like going la 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 la. Okay, so can I handle two of these guys well enough? Aside from Gigra, because definitely yes. My gosh. No, these guys definitely hurt really hard. Hurry up and die, please. Not you, please. Probably should have used a stronger restore. So Sir Rosser says that he remembers the good old days of RPGs where grinding was not only encouraged but often required. Yeah, this is almost one of them. I'm able to get through most of this game without grinding, but at this point it seems like it would have been required. That said, I prefer not to do any grinding. I kind of want to see how much progress I can make without grinding. And in some games, it's actually not that difficult. Basically, my issue with general grinding is... It's so much a waste of time. Oh, that's right. Rika's got Gisar. Hold on to that, though. Because... All you're doing is walking circles around town just fighting the same monsters over and over again. It's, it's boring. So what I kind of like to do is see how far into a dungeon I might be able to get without grinding. If I need to, I'll escape the dungeon and have enough money to buy some new equipment and stuff and I'll also have gained a few levels. And then my next trip, in theory, would be easier. And I might actually have to apply that strategy to this place. In fact, I've already used that strategy throughout this playthrough. There's been multiple times where I take an episode break in the middle of a dungeon. Oh, this is Lee's somewhere. I'll take a break in the middle of a dungeon, escape and heal, and come back, and my next trip will be easier because I'll have gained some experience during my first trip. Stairs going down. Treasure. Lots of directions I could potentially go here. You guys are still looking as sucky as usual. I think I can get away with regular gravity though. Dang critical hits. It's been a while since we've been hit by one of those, but ah. 
Oh, why'd you miss? This is not the best time to miss. I might have to escape this dungeon and heal if only for the sake of getting my MP back. TP, whatever. Does this lead somewhere? Uh, yep, it's leading somewhere. Is this somewhere I want to go? I don't know. So, you know what? I'm heading back this way for the sake of checking out those stairs, because maybe the stairs are where I want to go first. Now this fight I can definitely handle. Those guys with the big knives, not so much. Big heal for Rika. So what's down the stairs? I bet it's treasure. Or it was a complete waste of time, that works too. Okay. Considering I'm definitely, probably, almost certainly going to have to leave this place to heal up, I kind of hope that I don't have too much trouble remembering which paths I need to get, or which paths I need to take in order to get back to where I was. Alright, regular Sue is enough. And... You know what? Sure, Giwat against the stone heads. Surprisingly, a gravity spell against all of us is not as threatening as it should be. Oh yeah, this magic's definitely helpful. So to the right is a nowhere. Path seeming to go down this way, yep. Okay, let me check inside the door at the very least. That seems to be going places, maybe? I don't know. Oh boy, do I really want to deal with these guys? Not really. Okay, this is definitely leading somewhere, so I'm gonna check that other path. Okay, you guys, you hurt, but I feel like I can probably handle you. That said, have a giwat. Oh... The misses are being especially unfortunate. Here, have healing now. You need it now. And some more healing. I'm never really a fan of when I have to heal after every single battle. It really ruins the pacing. Oh, this doesn't even lead anywhere. I thought this was like a bridge I could walk under. So where is this leading? Okay, I can definitely handle this fight, sure. I'm going to definitely take priority on buying armor before weaponry.
You know, I still don't know what happens when you get a game over in this game. Whether you get to keep your experience or if you're kind of hosed and lose all your progress. Why'd you miss? You of all people are the least important to miss something. Let me try it again. Why'd you miss? You can actually damage it. Ugh. Okay, um... You defend. I said defend. Don't miss this time, please. Thank you. Are we up above where we were before? Where is this? Random dead end for the sake of dead end? Well, at the very least, you don't have random encounters outside, it seems. So I'm thankful for that. Bye! Try, mate. Um... We got another antidote we can toss, I guess. Oop, nope. You hit that thing, and I do mean hit it. Don't miss it. We do not need to prolong this fight any longer than we have to. Of course, we kind of are because people are missing, but... No, that's basically the end of my statement. I want to try to make it as far as I can before... ...escaping to heal. That's not a bridge. Oh boy, and, and the, all this traveling around is just to get it through the rest of the entrance. Hopefully there's not a whole lot after the entrance. Okay, we got multiple places to go here. Let's start by finishing exploring down here, because I'm pretty sure that down here, if there's anything at all, it's only going to be treasure. Or there's also a whole lot path down here. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of path down here. My gosh, this place is big. Why was that a critical hit? Forget, forget that, why was that a first strike and a critical hit? That kinda sucked. Uh, no, you go ahead and do a regular attack. Can you wad against that guy? What else do you have? High jammer? I forget what that does, but I only have one of it, so I'll just ignore it for the time being. Use a flare. That was decent damage, I guess. Ah, nut bunnies. Okay, what's down here? A whole lot more path is down here. 
Am I sure this is the wrong way? I really don't like how fast these guys are. Leveled up for Kyra. Cool. I'm gonna to have to escape here real soon. Kyra is almost out of healing. Okay, treasure here. What is it? We'll find out after I run from this fight. Because I do not have a great way to deal with those guys, and they definitely hurt. A helmet! I'll take a helmet, sure. Who's the helmet for, I wonder? Maybe I'll be saving a little bit of money from finding this. Helmet for Chaz. So that additional defense power, agility goes up. That's something that's pretty good for this situation. Mental power down. I don't know if mental power affects magic defense. Oh, the, the rest of the stats though, the boost is good. So yeah, Swift Helmet is. That's a dead end. Yeah, you guys suck. You know what? Hmm. How do I want to handle this? You're not the right person. You're not Rune. You need to, like, dress yourself in a different color, please. You know what? Here. You got some good stuff. Use Disrupt. And throw in a Gra for good measure. That went well. And just in time for Rika to level up. Okay, um... I might as well see what's a little further ahead. I'm definitely going to escape this place and heal up, though, at some point here. Just as soon as I find what I'm looking for. Also, Kyra definitely needs a second boomerang. Here, throw in a Gizan. Not especially strong, but hey, it hits both of them. Ah. <sighs> That battle could have ended without taking any more damage had that one person not missed. Kind of think of it, am I even able to use an escape spell here? I mean, we kind of had to fly here on a spaceship. If we use an escape spell, where would we even go? Somebody else can heal. Rika, you got MP to spare. Let's see what Gisar is while we're thinking about it. So you got 119 MP. Heals 90 HP each. And definitely consumes a bit of MP there. So we will not want to go crazy with that. Oh, that's right. There's two doors still here. Okay, this one's just treasure. I accept treasure. Genocyclone. Okie doke. 
I know who that is for. It's a question of what we want to replace. I feel like Thunderclaw is what gets rid of those enemies, but... Uh, we'll try that for now. Maybe maybe the Thunderclaw isn't it. Maybe it's the silver thing that really hurts those dimensional eye things. My gosh, this place is huge. Okay, treasure was on the left. Alright, these are not the one thing, so... Go ahead and do a regular attack. You still have enough MP to spare, so... Gravity. Hopefully we're not too far from the end of this dungeon. Okay, what we got? Escape pipe. Um, I have one of those. Yeah. Oh, we can put it back. That's good to know. And more of this. some more Sir Rosser says you know for a dungeon full of bloodthirsty mutants this building really does have some nice plush carpeting is this carpeting I assumed it was tile Either way, this place is not doing a very good job at helping me feel comfortable. Are we almost at the end of this? That's a entrance there, and this leads... What is this? Did I just get healed? I just got healed! Don't suppose this is a save point? Aww. Well, whatever. I got healed! That is a good thing. What's through the store now? So, I'm behind these guys now, and... Huh. Well, whatever. Okay, I need to figure out what I want to do here. Now that I've found out that this is a thing, do I want to... Take the time to escape this place, heal up, and buy some equipment before I go whatever is coming up. Because you never know, the next boss might kill me. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. It'd be better. Oops. It'd be better if I could save here. But since I can't, I'm not taking any chances. I'm going to. Wait, can I even use the escape pipe right now? Or escape anything? Let me check here. Yeah, it works me to the entrance of the place, in case you're wondering. So, I'm going to go ahead and spend my money on the things, equipment, and we'll be back to that room when we come back.